What is up with everyone? Paul from Silence Gaming here, and today we're going to be going over how to get the M13B inside of the new game mode DMZ in Call of Duty Modern Warfare 2. So, once you start it up, you're going to see that you have to kill someone called the Chemist within DMZ. Now, DMZ is sort of like a Tarkov kind of game mode. If you die in there, you lose whatever weapons you have. So it's going to be a little hard. Make sure that you go in with good weapons if you have any. And try to get to him as fast as possible. Your best case scenario is to have a game where he spawns as close to you as possible. So as soon as you spawn into DMZ, you're going to go ahead and pull up your map as fast as possible. Now, as you guys can see, it spawned very close to us. But some games, you won't be so lucky. If this does happen, you're just going for the chemist. You can go ahead, extract, get into another game, and just keep doing it until you get a chemist that comes close. Now, once you get to the initial area, there's going to be a alert that's going to tell you the chemist is nearby. As long as the skull on your screen is here, the chemist is still alive. If you get to the radiation zone and it turns out that you do not see the skull, go ahead and extract. It means that someone else in the game has already killed the chemist, but... Don't be too worried about that. If you do see the human players that did grab it, you can go ahead, kill them, and grab the M13B from them. But, of course, in case this doesn't happen, they've already extracted, just go ahead, extract, and come back in. Once you get here, there's going to be veteran-level enemies that you're going to have to go ahead and kill. Not only is it the chemist, who is absolutely OP, armor that is absolutely just insane, and enemies that are protecting them but there's going to also be of course human players coming in as you guys can see right here trying to also do the same thing you're doing which is kill the chemist and get this specialized gun so you can unlock it in modern warfare 2's regular multiplayer so once you get in here you go ahead make sure you pick up a gas mask as well or else your health will slowly deplete deplete because of the radiation every enemy will drop a gas mask so as soon as you kill an enemy grab a gas mask and go ahead and as you're killing enemies if your gas mask slowly depletes too far you can grab a new one they will all have a hundred percent gas masks on them now once you go ahead and if there is any human players make sure you kill them as fast as possible as well as killing all of the AI enemies around now once you find the actual chemist he will be in this light yellow hazmat suit he's very very hard to miss you guys will see he's actually inside of this building right over here and he's just chilling in there so once you jump in there he is that's exactly what he looks like once he is dead he will drop the specialized m13b assault rifle on the ground you're going to go ahead head over to his body pick it up it's going to be this bright yellow gun and once you pick it up you're going to go ahead and you have to now extract now extracting is going to be a little bit difficult because there are going to be other human players extracting in the game and if the ai also will be coming at you as you call for exfil now once you get to whatever exfil site that you've picked you're gonna go ahead call the exfil and you have to survive until the chopper goes ahead and lands for you guys to get on now, once it's inbound, you're just going to go ahead, try to defend the point as best as you can and as fast as you can. The chopper does take about 30 seconds to a minute to actually come in. Come in and then once it lands, you're going to have 30 seconds to jump on to the chopper. If one of your um, teammates or two of your teammates jump on, it will drop down to 5 seconds. So you will only have 5 seconds to get on. If you do die before the, uh, you get into the chopper and you don't extract with the M13B, you will have to do this all over again. Best case scenario is to have the best gear once you're going into that radiation zone. Do it as fast as you can as soon as the game starts. And you should be good. Of course, there might be other enemies that get there before you kill the chemist. Whatever it is, just keep retrying. It took us about four hours to do it. But like I said, once you go ahead, hop into the chopper. You will have, like I said, human players and AI firing at you and trying to kill you. As a matter of fact, our whole squad right here got downed. But luckily, most of us had a self-revive. And as long as you're on the chopper and you don't fully die, and you're just in that uh, revive kind of state, you can still ex uh, extract with 
the M13B, so don't be too worried about that. It's only if you fully die. And boom, successful exfil. Once you get that, you will see it pop up on the screen, and it will tell you, new weapon unlocked, the M13B. It's as simple as that. It's very, very simple on paper. When you're actually trying to do this, like I said, it took us about four hours to even get close to getting this done just for me. And it's called the Health Hazard M13B. Now you don't get the special blueprint inside of regular Call of Duty Modern Warfare 2 multiplayer. This will only be available inside of the DMZ game mode. But if you do go in and you do die, you do lose it. But hopefully this helped. Thank you guys for watching. Be sure to like, comment, and subscribe for more content. We'll see you guys in the next video. And remember to stay timeless.